This morning over breakfast, I watched a <clears throat> hour and a half documentary on YouTube uh, about the Korean War. And I realized that I'm not that far from Wolmido, the island that the Americans at MacArthur's forces landed on. So I am going to go over to Wolmido. There's no geocache over there, so I'm thinking I might hide one because it is an historically important uh, place. There should be a geocache there. So that's what I'm doing today. And I'll probably find a few geocaches. There are not that many in Incheon, but I will probably find a few. There are a few over there. So let's see how it goes today. Join me. This is the Incheon Chinatown. There's a cache in here somewhere. Maybe I should get that before I head out over to Wolmido. This is the main drag for Chinatown. Lots of red places with dragons. Uh, it looks kind of interesting. Traditional wedding garments. So this is Wolmi Park on Wolmido, Wolmi Island. I was always told that eggs came from chicken, but I'm starting to double think that now. What the heck? What I've discovered is that you can walk around Walmido. But inside this fence is a wildlife preserve. You can't go in there. But there are signs that uh, say there are deer here. The signs say like, uh, love our deer. So, there are deer in Korea. They're, they're a small breed of deer, but they are all over the country. I've only seen deer here a couple of times out of 17 years. So, I mean, they're not overrunning the place, but they exist. The invasion force came from that direction and bombarded this island. Uh, it was being controlled by the North Koreans. And then, 12 hours later, when the high tide came back, they could proceed and attack their main objective, which was Incheon. They wanted to get over there. That's the mainland over there. And once they got on the mainland, they moved to cut off supply lines for the North Koreans. The North Koreans controlled everything on the Korean Peninsula except one small corner in the southeast near Busan. That's it. They controlled all the rest of Korea. And General MacArthur was going to cut them off from their supplies so they would either surrender or try to get back north out of South Korean territory. Yeah, the tides in, in, here in Incheon are phenomenal. There's quite a big difference between low tide and high tide and the invasion had to coincide with high tide where the ships wouldn't be able to get in close enough. It's a pirate ship called the Viking. <laughs> All right. Anyway, maybe you remember a video I made a long time ago about the Ferris wheel in Busan. And the reason I didn't go up on it, it's on top of a building. This one is not on top of a building, but it is still too tall for me. I could never I would freak out if I got in that thing. Unfortunately, I can't enjoy stuff like that.
열차가 들어오고 있습니다. 한곳 안쪽. I decided to get off the train. I got off at the uh, Incheon bus terminal and decided I was going to just take a bus back to Suwon. And this, and the bus leaves at 5 o'clock. So any minute now, it'll show up. That was my little adventure in Incheon today. A lot of hiking on foot. A lot of bus riding, a lot of train riding. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you again in my next video. Thanks for watching.